Shane Cotton is one of New Zealand's most high profile and successful contemporary artists. And for the past 20 years, he's called Palmerston North Home. It's all good to go. It's not the hustle and bustle of a place like Auckland. It's got a different vibe to it, which I quite like. While he now has a spacious studio, he once crafted his valuable artworks in a small garage. Palmerston North being sort of in certain views, especially to the north and to the west, very, very flat. So, but you always had an incredible kind of horizon line. Like on a good day, you can actually see Taranaki, Ruapehu and things like that. So it made for an interesting a view to the place, which I quite liked. Cotton's been described as a visual magpie, as he combines images and ideas from Tapuna or ancestry with those from today. His latest project uses brightly coloured heads. Yeah, well, I mean, colour's just purely, uh, it's an intuitive thing for me. I don't think about it too much. I just throw it on there and see what it looks like. Quite often we think about ourselves as like being sort of in the moment. We understand things, we understand history because we can look back on it. And I think what these are is actually more about becoming something. And this idea that, um, that there is a sort of a fluidity and transformation that happens in, in the heads that allows us to think about things outside of a stepping off point, I suppose. And I kind of like those ideas because they sort of relate a lot to the practice of painting and um, just, you know, what the heads become what they sort of say, or how they say it, I suppose is of interest to me, because of how you actually translate those things in paint. His paintings highlight deep and diverse cultural histories. He says it's part of a bigger journey. The information that's been brought into the head is more to do with the body as opposed to the features of the face. So it's kind of like it's, these are, because these are obviously based on Mokomoka images. They don't have any bodies. And so there's this idea that the body is actually placed within, it's held within the, the space of the head. That's just one of the ideas. But I think the thing for me is, you know, what is the nature of the future for Māori, I think, or what is the, what is the future of one's identity? And, and so, you know, I'm not saying that these paintings can actually answer that, but I'm interested in sort of how that, that journey sort of, um, you know, as we grow as a nation and as Māori, um, sort of move further into the future, um, just how important are things like tradition and, and um, what we know to be sort of customary sort of habits and routines and rituals, you know, how sort of critical and important are those to the to identity, I suppose. Cotton will have a mix of older and more recent work on display at the Auckland Art Fair from May 23rd to 27th at The Cloud. Alexander Robertson, Local Focus.